Hey, it's me again. In this video, we're going to talk about something called GLA, gamma linolenic acid. Now, in some recent videos that I've done on fats, I've talked about the difference between omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids. Omega-6 being more inflammatory, like the soy, the corn, the canola, the cottonseed oil that you want to avoid, which is in most dressings that you would buy. I mean, look at the first ingredient. It's, it's hard to find a dressing without soy or corn oil or even uh, canola. I would avoid it, plus it's GMO. So I wanted to differentiate this fat from the other ones because this one, even though it's omega-6, it's anti-inflammatory. In fact, it's a very powerful anti-inflammatory fatty acid. It's in borage oil, black currant seed oil, evening primrose oil, hemp oil, but borage has the most GLA. So that's probably the one I would recommend going with. So it's really beneficial for the skin. Eczema, psoriasis, flaky skin, various inflammatory conditions like rheumatoid arthritis, osteoarthritis, and inflammation in your arteries. One of the big problems in cardiovascular disease is the inflammation. Well, GLA is anti-inflammatory, so it'd be really good for the heart. And it's good for asthma. And the last thing it's really beneficial for is the endocrine system, specifically female hormones, menopausal. So if you're menopausal, have these other issues, definitely get some GLA. And I also recommend combining this with your healthy omega-3 fatty acids, which is the virgin cod liver oil, egg yolks, of course. Chia seed is very high in omega-3. So if we combine the healthy omega-3 with the healthy omega-6, you're gonna be in good shape. Just to remind you, omega-3 would be like fish oils, nuts, like walnuts, egg yolks, chia seed, all real good. The fish oils, specifically my favorite, which is virgin cod liver oil, will also give you another healthy fat called DHA, which is really good for the brain and the retina. All right, well, thank you so much for watching. Before you go real quick, I have a course entitled How to Bulletproof Your Immune System. It's a free course. I want you to take it, and here's why. Here's you, here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself, and so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below. Check it out and get signed up today. Hey, before